Hello, my patients. The doctor is in, and welcome to the February episode of The Appointment. Tonight, we got a good show for you tonight. I'm joined with my co host, uh, MASH45P. Hello. Tell the folks what we have in store for them, MASH45P. Well, this month, we have the plays of the month, which are quite exciting. I'm actually featured in a couple of them. It's quite nice. We have Ben interview, Ben's interview, yeah. which that's I've seen a preview of that, so I'm looking forward to watching that. We have Craig plays scary games. Mm-hmm. Uh, we have a Q and A, so a question and answer with you, and I'm sure I'll somehow get dragged into that too. Uh, and then we got a spicy challenge. And when it comes to spicy things, I, on a scale of zero and habanero, I am a. So I'm pretty much looking forward to that and dying tonight. All right, so the first segment of the show is Plays of the Month. You guys liked it last month, so we're going to keep it. And uh, so my favorite play this month was when me, me, Mash45P, and Ginger, that guy, that guy. he's off screen. He's all, he's all good. He's a studio audience today. Um, but we played Prop Hunt, and uh, so check this out. Roll the clip. Shh, don't tell anything. You can't say anything this one. Well, yes, those were some fantastic plays of the month. Well, my plays of the month are when we were playing League of Legends together, and we were bot lane, you were ADC, I was support, and I was just carrying you all day long. Roll the clip. That was some good, uh, good support playing there, Colton. Did real good. Uh, the next segment is we uh, interview Ben, our friend uh, way up in north, and uh, we're going to see how he's doing. Check this out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're here with Benjamin Newsom. We're here to ask, ask him a little bit of a questions about uh, what kind of what kind of things he does up in the Great White North. He's uh, he's a kind of a special guest with us today. So Ben, our first question: um, What's it like to live up in uh, Chetwind there? Well, it's a special kind of place. The uh, ever encroaching sea of madness constantly is on the edge of your uh, mind, and you never really sleep. <laughs> Not a joke. Anyways. <laughs> no, very real. <laughs> the next question is, what are the people like up in the Chetwind area? Yeah. Well, I'd like to say soulless, but uh, it's actually more evil and corrupt than that. <laughs> I also wanted to ask, Ben, what, what, what do you do up there? What, are, what is your profession? Yeah. I'm actually a dead stalker. I deal with things that die on our roads. Which is everything. <laughs> so funny. Ah! Woo! Yeah! Woo! I love that guy. 
thank you, your studio audience, for that amazing. Um, what other hobbies do you? What, what do you do up there for fun, there, Ben? Generally, I drink and shoot anything that doesn't have two legs. <laughs> Maybe not in that order. <laughs> That'd probably be best. Um, any other hobbies that you'd like to say to our folks there, Ben? Sometimes I curl up in a fetal position and try to forget about how alone I am. <laughs> He's so depressed. <laughs> <laughs> That's no laughing matter. Depression is a serious, uh, serious condition for uh, for most there. But uh, but anyways, we will see you again, and in, uh, in some other time. <laughs> okay, <laughs> see you guys. Have a good one. My, that was a great interview. Your interviewing skills are really coming along these days. I know. I know. Thanks. It's true. Well, now we get to move on to the next portion of our uh, appointment. And that, that is when we get to watch a very special game. It's a, spare, it's a scary game, not a sparrow game, a scary game. And this is with one of our, uh, one of our good friends... Who tends to scream like a little girl? Let's roll the clip. Oh, damn. What was that? <laughs> I can, like, sprint if I needed to. Whoa! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Ooh, that freaked me out. Oh, actually, for the very many times I've just visited this place, having a red balloon... Whoa! That thing, though. I will never sleep. Like, I'm done. I, like, what? Oh, my goodness. No words. Just no words. Whoa! What the hell is that? What is that? We're gonna go down the other hall. Oh, so it throws me back in the game for another so round. Oh, for so sure. This will be great. I'm gonna die. Yeah. No! I don't. I'm done. Like I don't want to play this game anymore. It's not letting me. I can't even. I'm done. That's it for me. I'm done. Live from the doctor's office, it's the appointment with Dr. Fallout and MASH. I forgot the rest of your gamer day. Woo! Every month we endeavor to answer some of your questions that you have for the doctor and whoever happens to be his unlucky co-host. Yeah, buddy. So, this week, we have some questions that have come in for Dr. Fallout. Why are you staring at the screen? <laughs> it's actually staring kind of throwing me off. I'm, I'm a little bit terrified. So uncomfortable. I'm uncomfortable, and I'm not even watching. <laughs> Do you want to answer any of these questions? We can skip it if you I'll want. I'll answer all the questions you wanna, that, okay. my, that my patients have for me. I might answer the occasional one, too, just to feel included. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Serious faces, guys. Okay, Sorry. Okay, serious. Let's go. Let's do this. All right. So our first question comes from Transcendence Forty Nine. How did you get started into YouTube? Well, well, <laughs> I really, <Bye>, Mike. <laughs> I really enjoyed uh, when I got it first. When I got into YouTube, it was uh, I was you know nineteen and a half, <laughs> and. Uh, yeah, I started like three months ago. I was like bored out of my mind, and that's pretty much all I did. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, uh, here's a. Or, I guess I need the microphone too. <laughs> We're good. <at> this. <laughs> Woo! We're pros. We don't technology too well. So the next one comes from uh, Maria Sanchez, Mary. twenty nine. Mary Sanchez. No, it's Maria. Mary. <laughs> Sorry, Maria. <laughs> Sorry. 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 You can't read still, Dylan. I I still can read. Sorry. No backlash <laughs> from our live studio <laughs> audience. <laughs> So from Mary Sanchez, twenty nine, comes. How old are you? Kind of already answered that in the last question, but I'm uh, nineteen. <laughs> well, I have nothing snarky to say back. Good job. Thanks. You yeah. know your age. Yeah. 
All right, so our next question comes from Tati, 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 Tatine. Didn't we practice these before? Tati Teen. Yes. Tati oh, Teen okay. 434. Okay. This is why you pay me the big bucks. Okay. I'm so glad I don't pay you at all. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not tell that to our studio. That's, uh, they, they think they're getting paid oh, still. This is cool. So that, that question is, uh, what's your favorite game so far? My favorite game... My favorite game would have to be... <laughs> Would have to be. Um, I really like Stranded that we just played, and but I'm gonna have to go with uh, Gary's Mod and Prop Hunt. It's super fun. There's no better game. Can I can I answer too? Oh yeah, oh sure. Let's. I'll give you the privilege. Hungry, hungry hippos. <laughs> <laughs> I can't argue with them. I like that game too. Good game. So we have another question also from them. Uh, it's uh, what's your favorite food? Well. I'm slightly disgusted. <laughs> that was gross. Next. Okay, so we our next question comes from Ashton underscore sings. What's your favorite word to say? Mine's taco. I still don't really know. Uh, I like chimney sweep. I'm going with that one. That one. <laughs> chimney sweep, eh? I don't know. Chimney sweep. Probably. I think that's two words. No, but no, if you say it like chimney sweep, I will punch you in the <laughs> kidney. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fall to peer pressure, Avery. <laughs> you might as well. He should have said Ryan. I like Ryan. Trains. Should be anti disestablishment. I'd love to say that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next. All right, everyone. Our last question comes from Milky Way G128. Did you eat my sandwich? Nope. There you go! I think I, I, Can I drop the you mic? Got so, no, you cannot drop my $100 mic. Well, we've reached the part of our show where we start going to our live studio audience for questions. Let's turn to them and see what they have to say. Um, yes, you, the ginger with no soul. What is your question? Do you play any sports? Do we play any sports? No. Yes. League of Legends is a sport. Esport. And and how about you? I like to play uh, lawn darts and horseshoes. So to answer your question, no, they do they don't play any sports. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so our next question from the live studio audience. Uh, yes, do the Tyrannosaurus Rex sitting there. Uh, this question is for Mash Forty Five P. How many hairs do you have on your body? Okay, so Mash 45P, how many hairs do you have on your body? About 20 if I count from the tip of my hand. There you have it, 20 from the tip of his hand. And uh, the little annoying one there. Yes, you. Yes. <laughs> Don't be shy. You haven't been shy all day, why are you shy Great now? <laughs> Come on, speak up! Um, what's 9 plus 10? <laughs> Directed to who? Let's just skip over to this one over there. Yes, you. <laughs> 21! 21! Exactly. All right, so what is your question there, you? What have you done with his socks? What have you done with his socks? They're here! I made them into a scarf. That is what he's done with his socks. He's turned them into a scarf. You're welcome. And yes, one from the ghost over there. Thought-provoking indeed. How many no, socks do you own? <laughs> what? <laughs> How many socks do I own? Yes, that's what he said. Well, 300, I don't know. And Roughly 300, that's excessive. Is it? Damn. Yeah, that's excessive. That's kind of yeah. weird. Oh. You are a bit of a freak. Just like clean socks, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Explain what we're doing, Colton. Okay. So I was stupid enough to challenge Ryan to some form of task. And after much review, we've decided to do uh, hot peppers. Now these are... What peppers were they again? Have an arrow? No, they uh, were... Saran? Serrano. They're Serrano peppers. Uh, I looked up how hot a Serrano pepper is. I went to the local store and got the hottest thing they had. 
I looked up what a serrano pepper was, and it is a three times, three to eight times, depending on, I guess, how hot the pepper is, uh, hotter than a jalapeno pepper. Now, like I said in the intro, I am a wuss when it comes to hot foods. All my friends can attest to that. I am such a wimp. So, oh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> me and Ryan, who are almost, almost backing out, we're both going to do this. Okay, uh, throw up. <laughs> okay, we're not throwing up. We We've got milk in front of us. We've got giant glasses of milk. Giant glasses. Giant glasses of we milk. Might throw up for how much milk we have. My, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> sir, it was nice knowing you. Okay. <sighs> okay. Somebody, somebody count us down from five. Five, four, three. Two, one. Oh, I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> I bet right into the feed. There were so many scenes in that one. Stupidest thing I've ever done. It's been like 15 minutes and my face is still on fire. Alright, my patience. That was the hot pepper challenge. You can thank Mash 45P for that entertaining no. evening. No, no, never, never, ever again. <laughs> yeah, I should have had those during the challenge. Anyways. Thanks for joining us on this, uh, this appointment. It's been kind of a crazy night. There was a fire. We had some uh, in our mouths and on the stove. Uh, it was excellent. It was an excellent night. And uh, we will see you guys next month where I will be co-hosting with Canadian Ginger here. here for a second. See, this is what he looks like. He's a ginger, so maybe ask questions about how, how soulless he is. Anyways, all right, guys. We'll see you in the next one. And that's Doctor's Orders. Please like and subscribe. Peace out.